night. This growing scandal coming out of the IRS. Now, just hours ago, President Obama announced the forced resignation of the acting commissioner of the federal tax service days after the agency revealed that it singled out Tea Party and other conservative groups for additional tax scrutiny. Audrey Godfrey is live outside of IRS headquarters in the district tonight. She's got the latest twist on what's become a big White House scandal, Audrey. Leon, President Obama certainly didn't hold back tonight. He had harsh words for IRS officials here as he talked about new safeguards that are going to be put in place to make sure that specific groups aren't singled out in the future. And he also made it clear it's going to take new leadership here to help restore confidence. The outrage over the IRS has hit the White House. The inspector general report detailing just how aggressively members of the IRS were targeting conservative and Tea Party groups has put a spotlight on acting commissioner Stephen Miller, who we now know learned of the behavior back in May of 2012. That, it seems, was grounds for dismissal in President Obama's opinion. But Miller hasn't stayed entirely silent. In an op-ed for USA Today on Monday, Miller wrote, Mistakes were made, but they were in no way due to any political or partisan motivation. We are and will continue to be dedicated to reviewing all applications for tax-exempt status in an impartial manner. But it's clear the administration is questioning that, with the Justice Department investigating whether any criminal actions were committed. Politico's White House reporter Reed Epstein says it's unlikely, though, this will be the last head to roll. All right, so we seem to be having a little bit of trouble there. Now, Stephen Miller's resignation is not effective immediately. In fact, in a letter that he sent out to employees tonight, he said that he won't be stepping down until June. Now, he was scheduled to testify on Capitol Hill on Friday before the House Ways and Means Committee. The status of that hearing not yet decided. Live in Northwest, Autria Godfrey, ABC 7 News. All right,